to and I don't think I'm going to do much today. <laughs> I think I'll probably sit around, maybe watch some TV, eat a lot of food, tidy the house a little bit, but I don't know, there's not much I really mentally have the strength for today, so you're just probably going to see a few more montages of me doing absolutely bugger all. Good morning. Day two of lockdown two. Um, I am about to head off to work any moment now. It is freezing cold outside. It is, uh, seven, sorry, seven fifteen in the morning. And, uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to defrost my car, which is something I'm not looking forward to. Um, quite a busy day today, full day of teaching, prepping as well for one of the year 11 drama exams that is taking place next week because exams are carrying on as normal so life carries on i suppose so better head to work um i think she's shy um so it's lockdown day two Bye, Holly. You big chunky baby. Um, so it is lockdown day two. I've just woke up and I slept in. It's like 11 o'clock. Uh, but I blame the fact that I stayed up till like four. Um, I tried going to sleep, but then I kept waking up. So I just carried on watching Come Down With Me. Uh, I'm going to get up, shower. And do nothing for the rest of the day. Because that's the way that we do lockdown here. What are you doing? Turn the blinds open. <coughs> yes. sit and wait for them. No. She says fine if the birds don't want to play. You've been playing out. There isn't anything that oh she's gone. Look at the chunky girl. Aww. So you're really happy. So I haven't actually showered yet. Um, instead, I am editing the footage that I received yesterday. Um, whilst Kitty looks out the window. Because that's how she rolls. Um, and then after that I'm probably going to shower, change into some Queen PJs. That's how lockdown is and possibly start doing some sanding um i'm planning on decorating as much of my house as possible so tomorrow i'm gonna go out and get some gloss which we are going out for an essential purpose because we do also need food um and we're also caring for my grandparents tomorrow we have to take them a food parcel um so yeah lockdown day two so far very productive and what what are you planning on doing kizarina can't help but think she's been really rude and that the, she wags her tail like that when she sees birds because she thinks she's a dog it's also why she goes out on a lead because she's really stupid she's just seen her own reflection nice
I'm currently just transferring some footage onto my computer and um, whilst I do that I'm going to go in the bath and whilst I'm in the bath I'm going to brighten up my hair um, so this is like a little colour mask thing that I do every now and again um, and it seems I was supposed to be going to the hairdressers next week but I'm not now because of lockdown I figured I would brighten up my hair make myself feel a little bit brighter um, so yeah I'm using the Maria Nilla Bright Copper Colour Refresh um, it's basically a non-permanent colour mask and it does wash out um, but it just makes my hair feel a little bit brighter so it's uh, got like argan oil and stuff in it so it nourishes your hair and makes it feel really nice and I've been using it for like a year now I haven't used it that much since I last had my hair done and my hair's faded quite a lot because well because it's, it's due to get done in like four days but it's not getting done now until December which is sad um, but bright side is I'm booked in like three days before Christmas so my hair will be bright and colourful for the festive season um, but yeah I'm going to use this um, I will show you the difference afterwards I don't know if you'll be able to see it so much when it's wet I'll take my hair down excuse the state of it um, I don't know if you'll be able to see it so much when it's wet it might have to dry um, and I'm also going to tint my eyebrows and my eyelashes not that I'm going to be seeing anyone this is just for me because why not you know so I will show you doing that I'm not going to film myself in the bath because that would be weird Archie you okay you're a bit bored are you bored of lockdown as well Archie are you bored of lockdown as well So I'm going to tint my eyebrows first and then do my eyelashes. Um, this isn't a tutorial. If you do this at home, use the instructions because I'm rubbish at reading instructions as we learned yesterday. Um, this is going well. So I'm using the Isla dye brow and I have got dark brown. I did mean to just get brown. Obviously, my hair's not dark. I mean, my roots are. So we'll roll with it. We'll see what happens. I'm not going out for a month, so should have faded by then anyway. So then I'm just going to start by taking it and brushing it on.
Hello. So, um, say hello. So just a small reflection on my day. Um, once again, a very normal day at school. Uh, for the most part, we had our remembrance service today, which was lovely. Usually it would be a live event that happens with the whole school. Uh, but because of circumstances, it was a virtual event, all videoed. We all played at the same time across the school with our classes, which was really lovely. A lot of work had gone into it um, and made it really memorable. We still stood up at the right time and, and you know, uh, participated. So I'm really glad that we got to do such an important event. So I'm sat here now uh, thinking about things that are different this is where it will feel different for me with lockdown being the weekend usually at some point this weekend i'd probably see a friend um you know go out maybe watch something with them get a takeaway something like that uh which i can't do i know that is minor in comparison with some of the more serious issues going on but that'll be where i think things feel a bit strange different to me um but obviously the virtual remembrance service certainly felt a bit different and strange and obviously sad that we couldn't all be together but at least we still got to do that um so yeah we'll see how the weekend goes in lockdown well i've got some professor trelawney vibes going on with my hair today um Again, most of the day is gone. It is just before 8 o'clock in the evening and I don't really know what's going on because it feels like, well it's felt like 9 o'clock at night since about 4. Um, I'm just sat chilling with my cat friend. You right there Holly? You being shy again? She's telling me to F off. Um, I actually have plans to go outside tomorrow, which is fun. Um, we are taking a meal down to my grandma and granddad's because uh, they're not able to cook for themselves and the carers do a lot, but they, you know, we, we want to do something to help out. Um, yeah, and then we have to go do a food shop, and also hardware shops are still open, so we might go get some gloss, because I need to start painting, and then I can sugar soap everything, sand it all down, and then paint. That's going to be my lockdown project. I also have a paint by numbers and a paint by diamonds, which I'm very excited to get around to. So we'll see, but I don't know how much more I'm going to film tonight. We'll have to see, because I am just going to watch some TV and chill out. Not that I haven't been chilling out all day. I might start editing this vlog now because I'm going out and I don't, I want to make sure it's out at a reasonable time tomorrow, but yeah. I'd like to take this moment to apologize profusely for my red light during my nighttime videos. It's due to bad choices as a teenager and laziness as an adult. 